Hello, I'm Tim Barrett. I'm the new Chief of Navy as of the 1st of July this year. My tenure in this job is for four years, and I believe there's a lot we must do. I've got three priorities. I did put them out in a message, but I know that not everyone reads everything that comes out of this office. I accept that. So let me just tell you now what those three priorities are. Firstly, we have a contract with government. Directed activity by government we must follow, and I will ensure and aim that we follow that throughout the period of the next four years. The second point, there's a lot of new equipment, new platforms that are being introduced over the next four years. My aim is to make sure that we deliver those safely and effectively. And lastly, we started on a journey, New Generation Navy, to change the culture within Navy to make it a better place in which to work. My aim is to make sure that we continue down that path. We've had great successes. I want to make sure we continue in that vein. Now, some of you might say none of these three priorities look any different from my predecessor, Admiral Griggs. Well, that's right. They are exactly the same. That's because they're the right aims that we should be taking, and they're going to take some time to put in place. So, very clearly, publicly up front, they are my priorities. Now, within that, I acknowledge that workforce is one of our bigger issues that we need to manage. So within those priorities, my aim will be to make sure we focus on settling and solving those workforce issues that have been around for a long time. We need to change the way we do business to make sure we meet the workforce requirements for 2018. The last point I'd like to make is this week is NADOC week. It's a week where we recognise the efforts and value of our Indigenous members within Navy and within the ADF. They have given service in the past, great service in the past, and now there are greater numbers that are joining the Defence Force, and in particular in Navy. I want to celebrate what they have done for us in the past and where we will go inclusively into the future. Thank you.